New this midday, captured. Arlington Animal Control tells NBC5 they believe what we see here is the coyote that attacked three small kids since the weekend. An animal control officer and an Arlington police officer teamed up to catch that coyote this morning at Parkway Central Park. Our Ben Russell is there live now to get us up to date. And Ben, this is news that the neighborhood wanted to hear. Uh, with good reason, Deborah. After not one, not two, but three attacks on small kids near this park just since this weekend, this coyote, this coyote captured this morning again, believed to be the coyote connected to all three of those attacks. We're told it actually charged at that animal control officer and the Arlington police officer who were out here along the road in front of Parkway Central Park. They were escorting kids who were making their way to a nearby elementary school, trying to make sure kids got to that school safely. We're told after that animal charged, they were able to corral it and that he was inside of this animal control SUV that drove out of Parkway Central Park at around 10 o'clock this morning as our camera was rolling. What happens from now? We're told that animal will be taken to their uh, headquarters. That animal will be put down and it will then be tested for rabies. Now, there has been concern growing in recent days, again, because of those three attacks. Last night, our camera was rolling as animal control officers spotted a coyote. They believe there are multiple coyotes that are nesting in this park. Uh, we saw them shoot at with what we were told was a non-lethal round at one of these animals, uh, and they were trying, uh, as we saw, to capture that animal. We also spoke with a man who lives near here, whose young son turns four years old today. That child was bitten on the ear and on the arm over the weekend. That father tells NBC5 he's concerned the park was not closed immediately. I feel like somebody has failed us some, uh, some, somehow to kind of just uh, enlighten us on what was happening. Yesterday, the director of Arlington Animal Control told us they did not shut the park down immediately, essentially because they believed the first incident would be a one-off incident, even though uh, if a coyote is to attack. It typically would happen around sunup or sundown. It would happen around this time of year. This is their mating season. They still believe it is a rare occurrence for an animal to attack once, let alone multiple times. So again, they believe that is the animal. It will be put down, tested for rabies. We can tell you the park does remain closed at this point. There are still traps out there. They're going to capture, try to at least, the other animals to make sure this does not happen again. Live in Arlington, Ben Russell, NBC5. Okay, Ben, thank you so much.